Hi, I'm Eric Hastings, and we're here in the... Give me that. Thank you. We're here in the Pines region of Mississippi, right in this purple area here. Not exactly sure where we are, but... Uh, oh, there's Pines. The whole area makes the perfect getaway for nature lovers. Or woodchucks, if you think about it. Let's hit the road, people. Throughout the region, you'll find plenty of parks and wildlife refuges where you can hike, cycle, canoe, or even camp out. To take the scenic route through the region, hop on the Natchez Trace Parkway. The roadway not only features stunning views of Mississippi's natural beauty, but also has historic markers along the way. There are plenty of places to get out, stretch your legs, and explore the original trail on foot. Famed playwright Tennessee Williams was born here in the Pines, right in Columbus. So my question is, why wasn't he named Mississippi Williams? <laughs> Writers. <laughs> With tours daily, the house is a great place to learn more about Mississippi's favorite playwright. Stella! I'll bet they get that all the time here. Just to the west is Meridian, and there's a reason for the horse. The city of Meridian has one of the few national landmarks you can actually ride. Come on. The Highland Park Denzel Carousel is nearly 100 years old, and it's the only one of its kind in the entire world. Meridian is also home to one of the biggest cultural centers in the region. Mississippi State University's Riley Center hosts a wide variety of performances. Inside, they've restored the old opera house so nicely, you could pretty much watch anything. Meridian is the home of the father of country music, Jimmy Rogers, and they have an entire museum dedicated to him. <laughs> we should all be so lucky. When do I get a museum? I want a museum. Jimmy's fans can also stop by his gravesite right nearby to pay their respects to the singing brakeman. Just to the north of Meridian is Philadelphia, lesser known than the Pennsylvania version, but far more, well, southern. Here at Williams Brothers General Store, the whole town gets basically everything they need, from slacks to saddles to cheese. Well, maybe not on the same trip, but you get the idea. Boiled peanuts. Come on, I'll show you. This is Mr. Peanut. That, they don't call you Mr. Peanut, do they? No, they call me Buddy. Buddy? We we'll start with green peanuts. They look kind of brown. Buddy green. What is this doing to them? Boiling with salt. I started at 7.30, that's my second batch. And so you just boil peanuts all day? Yep. The biggest draw in the Pines region has to be the Pearl River Resort, with its two, count them, two hotel casinos, the Silver Star and the Golden Moon. It's a galaxy of entertainment, people. Here you can also play at the Dancing Rabbit Golf Club with two of the most acclaimed courses in the country, the Oaks and the Azaleas. I've been here since six. At the top of the Golden Moon Casino, you can dine in style above the pines at the Galaxy Restaurant and relax upstairs at the Luna Lounge. At the end of the day, you come and see Philip, and he'll pour you outstanding dirty martini. Thank you very much. You know, they say in Mississippi's Pines region, you can get away from it all. Well, I don't know who they are, but it worked for me. I'm Eric Hastings, and that's what I got.